Hello, I'm the steward. This is my uh, next review. Well, they're all going to be next reviews. So, anyways, this is an old, well, not that old, Soviet Union publication. Yosef Visarevich Stalin, a short biography with a cost of five rubles. Published by some uh, state uh, political publishing, 1950. So it was originally given to, there we go, 1951 for a middle school graduation of the friend of my grandfather. He later gave it, gave it to my grandfather and that's how I have it. And let's open it. Proletarians of the world, of all countries, unite. Joseph Vissarovich Stalin, short biography. There's a list, Moscow, published 1950. Essentially it was sort of like a children's book. And there you go, there's his... Georgian face on the f first real page. Yes, Stalin, Jugashvili. You know, his birth date in Gori in the Tbilisi gubernia of the Russian Empire. Uh, that's him in his young age, 1894. It's interesting because there's, there's a lot of pictures of him in here. You see the uh, text is very big. It's, it's like a children's book. So everybody got this sort of book at... Uh, middle school graduation it seemed or at least for uh, um, if you had good marks um, and uh, there he is in his uh, 19, 1900 and his youth yeah I mean it's in, a lot of the photographs it's interesting to see I'll, uh, I'll show a few in a moment they don't look as authentic they look edited because, you know, of course, they would be because it's the Soviet Union, but uh, they look weird, sort of as if they were drawn. Uh, let me show you what I mean. Yeah, here we go. Uh, Lenin in the center, there's Stalin, there's Kalinin, March 1919, photograph. It doesn't look like a photograph. I mean, it's obviously a photograph, but it doesn't look much like a photograph. It looks edited almost, don't you see? And, yeah. It essentially describes his life, his uh, glorious revolutionary goals. And then later, you know, Trotsky turned against him, and he had to exile him from the Soviet Union. There's Lenin and Stalin in the mountains, 1922. So... Essentially, I guess it's just an element of uh, the old Soviet propaganda system. Kind of cute if you think about it. Nowadays, you, I mean, it's not really... It doesn't seem sinister now. I mean, he, like there's no Soviet Union anymore. Stalin and Kirov, Leningrad, 1926. So, later on it'll show. There we go, he's, uh, he's on the cruiser... Chervona of Ukraine. Uh, Chervona, Ukraine, yeah. Uh, and, yeah, essentially it describes his life until the current day when he's the glorious leader of the Soviet Union. There's him with the famous author Gorky. Uh, there's he among tr children in... Uh, sort of uh, the aerodrome of Tushinsk, I guess, of Tushin or something. Uh, yeah, I mean, there's not much to say. A few more images. There you go, Stalin. And you can see it also looks a bit unreal, almost like it's painted with a very fine brush, don't you think? And yeah, I guess that's it. If you see this, should you buy it? I mean, if you don't read Russian, it's kind of pointless. But uh, if you can, it's kind of a funny sort of thing. I mean, you probably won't be reading it all. I mean, you probably have better sources for Stalin's biography than this biased source. But it's kind of funny as a sort of an element of the times. You can laugh about it now, but of course, it's uh, it was uh, brutal at the time. And uh, yeah, I guess that's all.